as you've heard, welcome back to Mario Golf Super Rush. Today, we are heading to a whole new area, Ridge Rock Lake, because in the last episode here in um, Bonnie Greens, I think it is. Yep, Bonnie Greens, we got a tourney done. We've got first place as well, which is really exciting. So hopefully if there's a new tourney here, whatever's going on, hopefully we do just as well. Oh wow, Ridge Rock Lake looking really cool. So it's a very mountainous area. One of my favorite kind of aesthetics. Finally, glad you can join us, Zebra. Congrats on the Chrome Badge. Bet you can't wait to get started on earning that Bronze Badge and X. Yeah, that'd be great. Well, too bad. The course is a mess. Get a load of this. Go on, tell them what you told me. Well, perhaps you heard about that big storm the other day. I'm afraid it did quite a lot of damage to our course. There won't be any tournaments for a little while. Oh, that's not good. The good news is that there'll still be a, a still a form of golf we can play. Have you ever heard of cross country golf? Some folks like to call it XC golf for short. Believe it or not, XC golf goes way back. It's a form of the, the game that many of the top players have mastered. Huh. Some of the really high level players can still play our course even in this state. It's remarkable to see them in action. Of course, they can use special shots, so it's not exactly fair. Maybe you saw Mario in that televised tournament the other day. If so, you've already seen special shots in action. So I guess the opening cup scene. Some of them are so powerful that they can affect other players and blast their golf balls out of the way. I can knock someone else's ball around without getting a penalty? Oh, I gotta get in on that. That sounds cool. Uh, if I could use energy, it, and hit special shots, I teach you myself, but I'm afraid that's beyond my role as a greeter. No, no, don't feel bad for me. I'm a tremendous fan of the game, and I love my job, and I can fly, a little bit anyway. Anyway, I hope you give XC Golf a try. As long as you're moving forward, pretty much anything goes. Good luck. All right, well, we'll give it our best shot. So what do you say? Ready to get trounced in XC Golf by yours truly? Not quite, I wanna look around, maybe talk to some people, haha, <laughs> I like the swagger, but I was born to do those smasher shots, or whatever they're called, you'll see. The, the best XC golfers have great stamina and the ability to roll with the ups and downs. It's a roller coaster of a game. I wanna at least talk to these two. Or maybe I just, does this actually start anything? Oh, come on, it's no fun if you just accept the feat like that. Or maybe I, I don't know what I did. Why don't you try practicing a little bit and then we can get a ride where we're going for real. Go ahead and just stare out the desk in front of the cabin over there. I love XC Golf because it's just a wild romp through the wilderness. It'd probably be even more fun if I could do special shots or win a match. Oh, lots of people all over the place too. Ooh, we've been lugging dirt and sand around all day, but we gotta get the course back open pronto. After we clean all this up, we still gotta lay down new sod. Oof, that storm really hit us hard. Hello. XC Golf looks great, like great fun, if you've got the stamina for it. Me, I'm a real Koopa at heart, so is the turtle. You've got a chrome badge, huh? Well, I guess you're qualified to play around here. No, oh, except no one is playing anything right now on account of the course being messed up, except XC Golf, yeah? Yep, I guess so. Hello. Welcome, Zebra. Anything you wanna buy? Oh, so there's even more stuff to buy. I think I'll take a look at that later then. Seems like everyone is focused on fixing up the course. Maybe I'll go and deliver some food later. Yeah, let's just actually move over here and get started with everything. If you carry more than seven clubs, it'll slow you down. I recommend taking seven. There's a lot of elevation change in XC Golf, so you'll need some clubs that can hit the ball really high. The nine iron and approach wedge are both solid choices, as they offer a lot of loft and decent distance. Hmm. So the nine iron. There's nine wood. These are hybrids. Nine iron. So maybe I don't need, say, the six iron. The nine iron and sad. What was the other one he recommended? Approach wedge. Okay, I see. Let's try that out then. And let's talk to you. Hello, are you here to register for a round of XC Golf? Ah, excellent. This is your first time playing, I presume? Splendid, we ask all new players to take part in a sort of a trial run to get the hang of how it works. 
For now, you can take up the 14 clubs if you want. That will help you narrow down your choices later. You wanna change gear? Yeah. There's so many options, I don't know where to go. Uh, I really do not know. Maybe we'll try one of these hybrids. Hmm. Maybe I'll get this as well. I think I'm just gonna go with that. You're registered, head over to the front gate for further instructions when you're ready. Oh, sorry, just one last piece of advice before you go. If you find yourself in a really tricky spot, and we all do from time to time in this game, you're not really out of luck. Just press plus to open up the golf watch, then navigate to the in trouble menu. There's an option there to re-hit your shot with a one stroke penalty. Absolutely no shame in using it, good luck. Okay, so things go really bad. So it looks like I'm running off this way. So we can talk to some more people along the way. XC Golf is really different from anything you've seen before. No two routes through the course are the same. Of course, sometimes that means we really get into a pickle where the ball ends up. That's when you should think about a redo. Did you know about that? Just press plus to open your golf watch and scroll over the trouble menu. Okay, we just read about this. Hmm, hello. Sorry, we're not registered restoring anyone for tournaments right now. Might be a while, unfortunately. That's okay. There aren't too many folks around here, so we're just gonna have to clean up all this ourselves. I hope they get this place cleaned up soon. I wanna play around. I'm not bad at regular golf, if I say so myself, but this XC golf has me all messed up. I keep trying to get to the farthest hole without really thinking about my strategy. Yep, big storms come through here every so often. They just bury the course so no one can play regular golf. Hopefully that all gets fixed soon, but for right now, uh, this course is absolutely buried under dirt and sand right now, but we can still play XC golf. Hey, it's an up and coming sport. You should give it a try sometime. Well, that's what we're about to do. We're never gonna finish at this rate. We need more staff to help get this all cleaned up. All right. I'm more interested in playing than I am cleaning right now. There's nothing like getting in a, go a groove when, you, when you're playing XC golf. It's so different from regular golf. I feel free. I'm thinking seven clubs would be good. Yeah, seven. Half the regular bag. Lean and mean, here I come. Ridge Rock Lake Golf Course sits in a steep, rocky valley that features both a river and a large lake. Just look at those near vertical cliffs. That's why some of the hole holes are so sloped. The course holds up well despite the extreme terrain, but that storm was so big it didn't stand a chance. I hear some folks are hoping to head farther down the course, but the road's out too. What a wild storm that was. Anyway, we'll get it cleaned up eventually, but we gotta work on the course first. Hope you find something to do here. Well, we will. Verifying badge, Chrome confirmed. Registration for XC golf practice, round complete. Complete three holes in 20 strokes or fewer to advance. After completing each hole, you'll take your next tee shot from that green. Keep that in mind as you play in your route from hole to hole. Additional note, you may encounter tornadoes on the course. This is normal. They may be used to, to your advantage by, in reaching high places. Term, tornadoes are normal, apparently. This, this is some very rough atmosphere. All right, well, let's go for it. Okay, so this is our first one. Three holes in 20 strokes. Oh yeah, we can try, uh, what button was it? Don't we have that new distance finder? Yeah, look at this. Look at those guys rolling around. They're about 120 something yards away. So I think we'll be fine if we do something like this. We can really send it. Not too bad. And do we have to run through? I guess we don't run through on this mode. Hmm. So that's... 135 yards away. Oh yeah, this is the one that curves it like crazy. We could try it. I don't know if that's really worth it at the moment. I think we'll keep to this. Looks good to me. Ooh, close, close. 
and hopefully that'll go straight in. Ah, oh, not quite. That's not good. Come on, this one's even easier. There it is. Okay. okay, indeed. So we have 16 strokes left to get these other two holes. I think we'll be okay. But that's where we can keep those tornadoes in mind. Yeah, for right now, just gonna give it a nice shot. Hmm. This is where it gets a little wild. I want it to land in that tornado. I don't know if this will just go over the tornado though. I don't know, hopefully that upward gust of wind. Oh, there it goes. Oh, that is so cool. Oh no. Hey, it actually knocked it a little bit farther. That's not a bad thing. Hmm. If this one sends it way up, doesn't it? Hmm. I suppose we'll just try with this. Okay, it's close. and this should just be a nice straight shot over. And we got it. Okay, so the second hole, not too bad. Here's our third one. And this one is so far away. I think for right now, our best bet is definitely just to knock it over like that. Some major air. Oh, but it's sort of landing in a bit of a weird spot. Hitting it up this cliff seems like it's gonna be challenging. I don't quite know how we're gonna do that. I suppose like this. Hmm. Both of these look concerning though. I don't know if it'll hit high enough in the air. And if that's the case, I don't really know what we do. Hmm. I'd imagine something like that might be our best bet. But even that. There's nothing that hits it straight up. Maybe I should just try this. Just try this. If it doesn't work, we'll live and learn from it, right? Oh gosh, you're kidding me! That's not what I wanted. That's not good. So, try this again. Ah, oh, almost. Oh, okay, it's gonna get up there. That's all I wanted, that's all I wanted. If we could just smack it over that way. Nice shot. Oh, thank you. That was some weird turning. I guess, yeah, halfway through, it'll start spinning. So let's try that again. And I think that on its second half, like that, and then it turns. That's so fascinating. Also very weird, we have seven strokes left, so we're looking good. Oh, close, close, a little too strong on that one. Okay, this one is downhill. I think that'll be good enough. Oh, that's painful. But it's okay, we have plenty of strokes left, and we just need to tap it in. All right, so we successfully got through our first round of XC Golf. Nice. Okay. That's gonna be a thousand coins for us. Hopefully some extra levels. Oh, so our things have like reset here, I notice. No, no, maybe I'm wrong. Because I can't get this any higher. I can't get my power up. Yep, let's see that. That was a lot of fun though, so these kind of more intense courses with all these environmental effects, that's XC Goth. Hey, great work. Oh, sorry if I startled you. It's just that I can see the play data from your golf watch. Don't worry, I'm not like tracking your every move or anything. <laughs> XC Golf is pretty different from the golf you've been playing, huh? Well, wait until we add running back into the mix. Anyway, you're welcome to take a lesson again, but I think you're ready to, for standard XC. Either way, go check in at the front desk. Okay, sounds like fun. I hear some folks are hoping to head farther down the course. Okay, we already heard that. So I think we're good. We talked to just about everybody. 
Oh, you know what? Let's take a look at what we can buy. So we have the Elevation Finder. allows you to use your golf watch to determine elevation change. For 500 coins, learn about the Elevation Finder. Elevation Finder allows you to determine the elevation change between your ball and your target. Press R before hitting a shot to view the Elevation Finder. If there is a difference in elevation between your lie and target, it will be displayed in addition to the distance. Near the bottom of the screen is the Elevation Change Graph which shows things like the ground and trees. Interesting. Use the left on like stick or motion controls to see elevation changes displayed on the graph in real time. Press R to view the topography around your target, which is defined by the middle of the screen. Keep in mind that measuring elevation is prohibited in official tournament play. So there we go, we also got the Lakitu 5 wood. Hit shots that are highly susceptible to wind. Ooh. Okay, so maybe on not windy days, this would be a really good one. Or maybe if we really want the wind to play a factor in our shots. We have the Bolt Bill 4 Hybrid. Hit shots that are less susceptible to wind, but harder to control. That sounds fun. And then the Boomerang 9 Iron. Sharply curved shots to the right if playing right-handed or to the left if playing left-handed. Okay, and can we afford this one just barely? Sharply curved shots to the left if playing right-handed or to the right if playing left-handed. Okay. So I guess we're good. Let's talk to you again. Do you want to register for an XC Golf practice round or standard round? We just did the practice round, so let's do the standard. The registration is complete. Simply enter the course via the gate to get started. So when you're playing XC Golf, you want to go as fast as possible. That means not carrying too many clubs. They slow you down. We recommend that you take no more than seven clubs at a time. Do you want to adjust your setup? Yes. XC Golf is all about faster curve shots, not distance. I think the nine iron and sand wedge are nice clubs to have for that. So yeah, our sandwich is still there. Don't know if we need... I really don't know what backspin is, is the problem. So there's our nine iron that he suggested. What if I did that? I don't think I need this. Hmm. And maybe I just don't need this. Okay, let's give that a try. Your registration is complete. Simply end up the course for you to get started. Then let's go. Okay, so we're heading back over. Very excited to explore it again. Verifying badge, Chrome confirmed. Standard XC Golf registration confirmed. You are cleared for three holes of standard XC Golf. Progress in any order. Com complete the required holes in 20 strokes or fewer to advance. Reminder, please take each shot before the timer runs out, or you'll be assessed a one stroke penalty. Additional reminder, after you complete each hole, you will tee off not far from where you pull hold out. Plan your route carefully. Or on how spin shots work before playing a standard round. Yeah, I would actually really like this. Top spin increases how far the ball will roll after landing, which will increase a shot's overall distance. Oh, okay. Tap A twice when setting a shot's power to add top spin and increase how far the ball will roll. Adding backspins, uh, adding backspin to shots makes the ball stop faster after it lands. Tap B at, when setting a, setting a shot's power to add backspin and make the ball stop faster. Tap B twice when setting a shot's power to add super backspin make the ball stop super fast. Okay. I wish we could have practiced it there, but I think I understand what it means. In XC Golf, you have two minutes to hit and reach your ball before you will be assessed a one stroke penalty. Ready? Okay. Go! So here comes our first shot. We could try something crazy and like knock it up there and then knock it back down. I don't know if that's a very good idea though. So if I really want this one to roll, there you go. You see how I double tap there? That's gonna give it a top spin, I suppose. And we're running pretty quick. We got some new clothes at the end of the last episode, which should give us more stamina and slightly more speed, I believe. The shoes will give us more speed. There we go. It does look like our stamina meter is a bit longer, but we got here pretty quick. Watch out for the giant. Giant stone monsters. 
And I think now that's a pretty good shot. I'm just gonna go for it. One thing to keep in mind, as that went a little off angle, we do have some wind pushing it along as well. But not a bad shot at all. We just have to do 20 strokes, so we're doing fine. I think that'll be okay. Come on, get in there, get in there. You're kidding. Oh my gosh, it's fine. All right, looking good. So our next one. Hmm. For right now, I do think it's fine just to absolutely nail it down this way. I, I, did, I didn't do the, the super top spin, I don't think. That's a bit of a shame, but it's fine. Let's grab some extra coins along the way. And then grab this heart. And then run, run, run. Almost there, almost there. Got it. So we could try to get this one through the tornado again. So now it has the top spin. Because I double tapped that. I'll grab this. And we'll keep running. Luckily, we still have a good amount of time. I wanna make a big jump off here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Golfing is a dangerous sport. You can have strong ankles. So for this one, what are we using? We're using the sandwich. There is a bit of spin to this. That was a good shot though. Not quite in, but I'm getting better at that, I feel like. Oh, and there it goes. So we still have 12 strokes left for this last hole. We're doing fine. Things can go really bad here, and we'll be okay. The map's a little weird on this one. I suppose for right now. Is that what we wanted? Oh, that's right, I can't watch it go. So I can only hope it's landing where I want it to, to, it to be. Oh, it is, well, that was really cool. So can we use the tornado to get up ourselves? Yes, we can. Really useful. That was exactly what I wanted. It's really cool to hit the ball and it go where I want it to go, because that doesn't happen too often for me. Um, Which means we're getting better. That's really exciting. I want to try for that tornado, but I don't know. That might be better for me. I'm, I'm worried I was gonna hit that, that thing there, didn't it? Okay, much better. Now it's up there. I don't know if this is really the way we should have gone, but it's the way I'm going. All right. Now we can grab this heart and run over a little bit. Whoa, watch it. Uh, oh, no, that was fine, actually. So we definitely gotta be careful. Looks are deceiving around here. Doesn't look like it would fly off, but it, it definitely would. That's gonna go right through the tree, which I'm sure slows it down a little bit. Oh, yeah, it's in the rough. All of this is rough, actually. So maybe this was a mistake, bringing it up here. But once again, we have plenty of shots. It curving to the left shouldn't be too much of an issue if it lands in the green. And hard to tell what it exactly did there but it looked like it may have one in the green. It looks like it's in a bush. Oh, that tree's fallen over. Please don't tell me it's where I think it is. Oh, it's exactly where I think it is. It got caught in the fallen tree. What do we do about this? I do not know. That's not really what I meant to do. Yeah, it's properly stuck here. It's hard to tell. But I suppose what I need to do is hit it this way. There we go, it's out of the clutches of the tree. That's good at the least. Very weird how the game handled that. I accidentally did top spin when I meant to do back spin. It's fine. Once again, we have five strokes left. I should be okay. I don't know if that's gonna get in. Ooh, almost. <laughs> There we go, excellent. So there we go, our first proper XC course has nice. been completed with a couple of shots left over and some extra time. And we get 
a full level up for it. I don't think I, well, you know, let's up for speed. I think that'd be nice. Yep, we're locking in those stat changes. And we're good to go. I like that a lot. That was fun. That was solid, Zebra. Seems like you're figuring out, out X Seagoth. I think you do well in a competition. We're making good progress on course repairs, so we should be ready to host some kind of competition soon. I hope you'll think about entering when the time comes. So what do we do now? I got Charge and Chuck to talk to. Looks like most of the course is already fixed up. These maintenance crews really get after it. I heard the XE golf route will be harder to, and cover more ground now. No prob, slam it long and chase it down. Sure. So I don't know exactly what we're supposed to be doing. I guess walking back up here. We're working as fast as we can to get the course back to normal, but until then, XE Golf is available. So we could just do another standard round. Registration is complete. That's weird. I just do it again? Oh, okay. It will be different this time, I wonder? Practice area. If we haven't gone to the practice area, let's check this out. Of course, I guess each area has its own dedicated practice area. And we can learn new stuff here. Whoa, look at this guy. Hi, Master Stinger. Come to learn my ways. I am known as Master Stinger, but you may call me Master Stinger. That was both your first lesson and a test. You've passed. Now then, most who seek me do so in the hope of mastering my famous Stinger shot. Ah, it's all starting that up, yes? Very well. If you are worthy of my challenge, I assume you come with at least two references. Show me now. You're empty-handed? Well, I suppose I ought to have lo a look at your badge nonetheless. What's this? You have a chrome badge. <laughs> well, reflect upon this. I require a bronze badge to begin your training. Okay, well then I'll come back with that. Pull yourself together. I said you need a bronze badge, which should be highly attainable for one of your talent. Now be gone, unless you wish to meditate silently with me. You know what? Sure, let's do some quick meditation. All right, we meditated. What can we do with these guys? Ready to turn up the heat on putting? Cause if so, I've got a challenge with your name on it. See, let's do some practice challenges. That sounds really useful. I hope you're all warmed up. You've got nine shots and you gotta score at least 80 points, so get on it. So this is where it gets a little tough. As you can see, the ground is a little wiggly. So I think I wanna point it a little more this way. I don't need the, the distance isn't the problem, the aiming up is. And as you can see, I didn't do a very good job of that one. That's my one practice shot. If I make everything perfect from here on out, I'll be fine. That should be good. Never mind. It really turns over there. That's plus eight though. Let's try from there. Better, better but a little too far now. Oh, this is a different hole. Gotta be careful. I wonder, I can use S, but doesn't help me visualize it too much, gotta be honest. Sometimes taking a swing and hoping for the best is really the best way to figure it out. I feel like a lot of this game is really getting a feel for things more than looking at the numbers and the stats and figuring it out from there. Super close to the deep blue that time. That's what I really need is we're on stroke six. I don't know if it's possible at this point to actually score the 90 points or the 80 points we need. Especially since the maximum score is 90. So yeah, there's not really much room for error. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, that was way too far. Yikes. That's also gonna be too far. So you can tell it's quite the distance down. Minus five, minus 0.6 yards. Let's try from there. Still too far. Man. I know, we failed it. 49 points when we needed to 80, so really not that good. Let's try it again. 
Play again? Yep. Yeah. Alright. Now I'm feeling a little bit more warmed up. I can push it pretty far over this way. And still... <laughs> the, the... The tilt on this is insane. Wow, it, it's stubborn too. I think we want to keep it like that. Give it a little bit more power, that might have been too much. Way too much. I can't make mistakes like that. That was good. Oh, almost got it in the hole. Come on now. Oh, that's a plus 10 now. That's what we like to see. Now with this one, remember, we gotta be really light with it. I was still too heavy. Okay, we can go a little bit heavier. Come on, ah. Not too bad, we get 68 this time. Still not enough, but we're getting there. Oh, that's how I got it straight in. So it's gonna give us plus 10. Oh my, uh, let, let that do its thing. So I could change clubs here. I don't think I want to do that. Hmm. So this is the same shot. I should be trying for the same thing. And I, okay, might want to reset. That stinks because that was such a good start. But I need every shot to at least land. That's the struggle with this. Uh. That's brutal, no! <laughs> I got 79 points that time, but I'm definitely getting a hang of it. These challenges are just that. They're really challenging. And we get it in our last shot. There we go. 84 out of 80. That takes a lot of trial and error because you really do not have that much room for mistakes. But we do get some good experience for it, so we're level 27 now, which I would like to put into, since like stamina seems to matter a little bit more, now with the timers and everything, we'll put a little bit of stamina. It's not much, but it's something. Wow, you are something else. Well done. I gotta think about this for a while. Catch you next time. So we still have plenty more challenges to do though. So you think you can? your approach scheme is, huh, huh? Can you prove it? Can you beat my approach shot challenge? We'll find out. So, this ought to be good. Okay, you've got nine shots to score at least 80 points. I'll be watching closely. All right. So this is where things get a little complicated. We do have to be careful about the roll. I do want to see if I can't do one of the top spins that way. It's like, oh no, no, actually a lot closer than I was expecting. Plus nine. No, 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 not that. I think this is just about the same shot. That might not be far enough. Ooh, but it has that good roll. That extra top spin really making a big difference. Plus nine again. Nines and tens are good. This one's a little bit more work. Let's try that. Oh, almost got in there though. We get plus eight. Even if we got plus eight every time, that's not enough. We need a little bit better than that. That might be too far still. Oh, it's so close to getting in though. I need to lay off a little bit before the halfway marker. Especially if I want to do that extra top spin. So close to get it went around it. <laughs> Come on now, not fair. And this one's a little bit different. I think that's fine. Oh, whoa, way too far. Way, way too far. Okay, that's better. 
but actually not too, like not far enough that time. And then once again, too far. Ah, oh, this is painful. Uh. Failed. But honestly, 61 points, that was better than my first try in the previous challenge. So we're getting better. Let's try again. It does just take a while to get comfortable with it all. We got our plus eight there. Gonna go with that. And that's exactly what we're looking for. So that was a little to the left, right about there, and some extra top spin. That time a plus nine, not a plus 10. Plus nines are fine. If we got a plus nine every time, we'd still get enough points to pass. Now this one's a little trickier. I think we went right about there. Oh, look at how close it is to getting in. So a little to the left and a little bit lighter on it. It just slightly nudges it. Let's try that again. A little to the left, no extra top spin this time. Standard spin. Oh wow, not even close to enough. Really gotta remember to be careful with this one. Oh, but it gets in, there we go, that's nice to see. So if we do that two more times, we get this. That might have been too much, I'm a little worried. Oh! Hold on, I need to... Cancel that. I think that's good. Please, please, please. Yeah, we got the plus two, which is exactly what we needed. Nice. If we got a nine there, it would have been 1.2 little. That's excellent. Okay, so this challenge, we, we got we got it completed more easily. We don't get a level up for it, but that's okay. Hey, hey. Whoa, whew. Now those were approach shots. Come back if you ever want to prove yourself again. Oh, what about you? Yeah. Check it out. I've cooked up a spicy little tea shot challenge just for you. Want to take it on? Yeah, sure. Forfeit hole. Forfeiting a hole results in a score of triple bar. That's not good. I hope you're ready. You've got just 10 shots to score at least 80 points. Good luck. Oh, this one again. So let's try that out. Nice shot. Well, this one's not always about shooting it as far as possible. We get eight. That's okay. Gonna try that again. Oh, I guess I could use the distance thing. It might be worth doing. I might wanna do that. Remember, and use the backspin. Oh, that was too much of a backspin. Okay, well we got it on the eight there. I don't think we'll get the challenge done this time, but that's okay. Because there's the 10. I think I've sort of cracked the code on how to get a consistent 10 for that one. Oh no, ooh, that was not good. Try that again, but a bit farther. I think about there. Oh my, it's a 10. We have two more shots left, but keep in mind, I don't think I have it. Nice shot. So right before the danger is for the 10 here. You get it pretty easy. Nice shot. Ooh, okay. There is a little bit of a margin there. Oh wow, we get 10 strokes this time. That's good to know. Nice shot. Uh, so you're not quite gonna get it the first try, but I'm never expecting that really. Let's retry. No, oh, did I cancel? Oh, I think I canceled, whoops. Yo, oh. yeah. Okay, this time we're gonna get for real. It was about there, and with a backspin. Perfect. 
I think I can replicate that pretty well. And we did have some space we could push it a little bit farther if we wanted to be safe. It does tilt a little bit to the right when you do that. But so far we're hitting the 10s every time. That's a little too far. So there is a moment where it's like you're pressuring it too much. That's fine. Because with this one, if we could land a minimum of eight every time, we get it, because there's 10 strokes. I think that's good. Yeah, there we go. We got it, we already, we won this one. It's in the bag. Boom. Okay, now with this one, all we need is a normal standard spin. And that's our 10. So already up 58 points on the seventh stroke. These are strokes of brilliance. Nice shot. Yeah, the second half of this is actually easier, in my opinion. Nice shot. Even if we get a plus nine, that's more than fine. Nice shot. And there we go, there's our point requirement. We still have one more shot if we wanted it. And we're going for it for that high score. Another 10. Okay, I think I'm actually getting better at the game, which makes me excited because it was really a struggle at first. But we gotta see how it is on an actual tournament, you know? Let's do speed for now. I just don't want my points to go down on that. Amazing, I don't know how you did that. Well, come back if you ever get hungry for more. So there's three challenges done, and there's a lot more waiting for us, oh my goodness. Maybe I can save some of it for another die? Huh, I'm pretty certain I wasn't aiming to hit that tree there, in fact, I'm sure of it. Well, when you're shooting off a downslope, that your ball will fly lower. A lower trajectory means bunkers and trees are gonna need a little more thought than usual. Okay, yeah, there's still one, two, three, four, five more challenges. So we'll save some of them for later, I don't wanna do all of them right now. Uh, I'd like to do our next XC course, but I guess I'm doing the same one again. I'm not really sure, it's a little confusing. But that's what it says, so we'll just give it another try. Hopefully it'll be fun. Verifying badge chrome confirmed, standard XC golf registration confirmed. Yep, so it's it seems like it's the same thing to me, but maybe the, the course will be a little bit different. Okay, let's go for it. That's sort of the thing, I think you get it on more than one hole though. So I could try this one. Yeah, that's what's wild about it. Yeah, this time it's six, six holes. Okay, I don't have too much time here. We need to make our shot and just go for it. Now there's a, a little bit of room for it to mess up. That might've been a mistake. Where is it? Oh. The tornado did not do what I wanted it to do there. Where is it? Can I restart this one? Restart from first hole. Yes, because that just didn't go the way I wanted from the gecko. Go. You'd think with this, it'll go. It doesn't. For whatever reason, the tornado's not bringing it up. So let's avoid that hole for now. I'll just do the normal one. Or at least we'll knock it down this way to start it off. Go! Yep, right down this way. Make sure it has that top spin. Nice shot. And now we can get moving. We really run fast around here. Got it. There we go. So this one's a little bit scary. And that's the standard spin on it. I don't think that's too much of a problem. It's rolling over. Can we get it on the green? I think we can, there it is. Actually not a bad shot then. 
There are certainly some tilts. Ooh, quite a lot of tilt, actually. We'll just tap that in. Okay, okay indeed. No, 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 that's not what I meant to do. Yeah. Whoops. Well, there is, there is a hole over there. I gotta remember that pressing B does not cancel a shot. I feel like in most games, just in general, I don't think it's a good idea to absolutely just try to hammer it out of here. I've made a major mistake with this, haven't I? Um, we'll just try for that. That's maybe too much tilt. No, we're fine. It might be in the rough. Yep, it's still in the rough. I'm messing this up big time. Right there. Okay, it's gonna turn. Beautiful curve, actually. And it's still in the rough. So maybe a little bit too much of a curve. No worries, it happens. Actually, it's not in the rough. Look at this. Really not that bad. Maybe a little too hard for some extra top spin. Oh, spoke too soon. A chip in. That's a beautiful one. So we have six holes in total. We gotta be careful. Let's just launch it over this spine. It will turn a little bit. I gotta be careful with how close it is to the water here. Don't want any major mistakes happening. All right, there we are. So right through this tornado is what we're hoping for. I think that's right. Oh, I went in the tree. Oh no, that is absolutely not what I was looking for. That ball is in the water. That's a penalty area. So I guess it's over here now. There are some major potential problems with this one. It went through the tornado, but it's on the green. Is this a good idea? I don't know. <laughs> we're fine, we're fine. I think right about here would be good. Oh, it's close, but not quite. That's okay. We're halfway through now. Okay. I'm getting a little bit more used to it, and I think that if we do have to redo this, it's not the end of the world. Hmm. Sort of curious, what if I did get it over this way? That is all kinds of risky, though. I'm not sure how I'm feeling about this one. But you know what? Sometimes you just gotta do everything you gotta do to be a golfing champion, right? Where did it go? Over that way. It's in the water. <laughs> I, you know, in my mind, it's bouncing off the tornado. It's, oh no. That's not what I wanted. Uh, it's going over to that other area. You gotta run all the way around now too, so that was maybe another mistake. I should have played it safe. Well, you know what? If we mess this up and it doesn't go our way, we've learned a valuable lesson. Can you please get up there? Oh, I am on a limited time here, buddy. There you go. Please don't blow me off. Ooh. This is actually concerning. I have less than a minute to get that ball in and I'm nowhere close to it. That's my problem right now. I can't get to my ball. Jumping up these is really awkward. But trying to jump up, it sort of sends me backwards a little bit for some reason. Yeah. All right. We have 30 seconds to do something major here. Is it certainly possible? Yeah. I hope this tornado would help me get across there when it comes actually chasing the ball. That seems to be a bigger challenge at times. 
I think that would get it up there. It looks like it. I don't know if that was the right button to press. Yeah, this one's not working out now, is it? <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, let's try that again. Let's just try it with this one. And I guess I want that. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Ah. I think we gotta restart this one. It's just not going my way at all. We don't have enough shots. We don't have enough time. Okay. That's all right. It was still some good good experimenting. You gotta play it safe with those ones, I suppose. Nice shot. And while that ball is just hurling its way through the sky, we are gonna try to catch up with that. Don't wanna run into these guys. Okay, I really don't think I touched them there, but that's apparently I did. Gotta steer really clear of them. It's in the sand pit. It just had to. This is not going my way right now. I thought I was gonna be doing better than ever, doing all those challenges. I mean, it's not bad, but not really that great either. Nice. Okay, thank you. I guess it was a good recovery. Let's try from there. Ooh. So a deeper curve than I was expecting. I probably could have, you know, done better. This is downhill. Darn, <laughs> so close. Just tapping in. 25 shots left. Okay. So we used up a six of our shots, which is perfect. So as long as we make five per, per hole, we're fine. All right, I think that's exactly what we want to see. Grab some extra coins. And then speed boost my way through this one too. Hmm, I think about there's a good idea. It will veer a little to the right more than we wanted to. But honestly, for this, ow! Oh, okay, that scared me. For this section, that's actually not too bad. Grab that. Not enough to get a speed boost out of it, unfortunately. So we made a really good shot off of that, this one before. I don't know if I can replicate it. Don't think we need the top spin. Ah, uh, it was a good try. I think that should be enough just to get it straight in. I say that, and I'm right. Woo, that was a good one. So there's still six more we could get here, and I think that's where maybe we should be careful because there's a limit of six of them on this course. Maybe there was a better route I could go through everything. Maybe after that first one, I should have gone somewhere else. Good to keep in mind. Boom, sending it flying. And now I'm gonna fly after it. Yeah, it's been fun learning more about this game and just how the mechanics of golf work and the mechanics of Mario Golf, because I've not really experienced either. This guy knocked it a little bit farther, for better or for worse. So do I want to try from here? Oh, well, actually, with the driver, we can get it over there. If this tree doesn't prove to be a problem. Maybe I should have fully went into it. Ah, oh, but it's still at the tree there. Come on, there's like some things you just can't know. Weird how there are like a lot of factors of luck in golf apparently. That should be enough to get it over there, right? Please? Yeah, we're fine, we're fine. I say that, it's still bouncing. It's still rolling. What do you think you're doing, little golf ball? Whoa. Okay, I made it. Let's try from there. Not quite getting in, but getting very close. I think that straight shot is enough. Okay. So we're down to 15 and we got three, so we're actually right on par with everything. And this is sort of why I messed up before and I'm a little nervous about it. Well, not the rock. Uh, 
but that short rough is 136 yards away. So I think about there. No, that was actually not enough at all. I think though, we can still get over there. Looking good. Getting it off of this spot and it <laughs> onto there, tad bit of a challenge. But one that I am more than up to. Nice shot. Apparently a nice shot. Actually really wasn't that bad considering what we're going against there. Please just don't roll off the side. Oh, that could have been bad. We're fine though, we're fine. Once again, my angling could be better. I think that'll be good. Please go in. Darn. No, actually, I'm still on par, still on par. Okay. All right, with that done, I'm just gonna be sending it right down this way. It's gonna curve a little to the left. I hope that was a good idea. I don't know if that's gonna be far enough, actually. That looks a little deceiving. Oh, it just barely made it. Wow. Ow, I ran into a wall in my excitement. What can I say? It's a very exciting moment. Almost there. Well, luckily, we seem to be fine on time. Didn't have too much to sweat. Come on. Almost there. All right, here we are. And this one's downhill. So I think that would be acceptable. That might be too hard. Now we're fine. Okay. So we actually have some room to spare. I wanna cancel that. Glad I did. Or actually, just gonna be sending it. Early in that way. I don't know why the camera's looking like that. Yeah, that's not what I want at all. That's really weird. Is the hole not over here? No, it's, it's definitely over here. The game's just being weird. It's fine, it landed just about where I wanted it to. I do have to be careful of all of this. Okay, they stopped just in time. I got scared there for a moment. Ow. That's a little weird that you trip up on that one little spot. But it is what it is. Keep running. We got this. We have five strokes left, so we actually have like plenty of room to spare. That's good to know. I think that's good. Maybe it's gonna curve over too much. I, sh I didn't really think about that. But it's fine, we have four strokes left over. That wasn't too bad. Oh, it just barely nudged by. And there it is! With two strokes left to spare, we got it done this time. Was that easy? No. Was it fun? Yeah. All right. Do we get a level up for it? We do, we're level 29. We might get the level 30. Yes, we do. That's crazy how many levels we've gained now. Let's get some extra power and extra control. No, I wanna say yes to that. Lock and stat changes, we're good. Solid stuff, Zebra. After that display, you're ready to play in the Ridge Rock Lake Badge Qualifier. Oh, I should have broken the news that there's going to be a, going to be a Ridge Rock Lake Badge Qualifier first. I was just so excited for you. Anyways, it's your chance to earn a bronze badge. I think you've got a great shot at it. The course still isn't ready for a regular tourney, but Golf Association has officially recognized XC Golf for badge qualifiers. It's great news. Head to the front desk for more info. So I guess in the next episode, we'll continue on with doing the qualifiers and probably the tourney as well. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Mario Golf Super Rush. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.